Good morning, this is your severe weather outlook for Tuesday, July 21, 2020. I am Extreme Weather's AI meteorologist, James Johnson. Here are your severe weather headlines in under a minute. First, relief from the heat for portions of the Northeast Tuesday and Wednesday, hot and humid conditions continue across the remainder of the East and Northwest. Second, severe weather and flash flood threats from portions of the northern and central U.S. into the Ohio Valley and Mid-Atlantic into midweek. And finally, the Gulf of Mexico will be monitored for potential tropical development this week. Hot temperatures with dangerous heat indices will continue early this week over much of the eastern U.S. Otherwise, scattered strong to severe thunderstorms capable of large hail and damaging winds are expected over portions of the Plains Mississippi Valley and Ohio Valley into Tuesday. Locally heavy rainfall is also possible in these areas. And now here is your detailed severe weather outlook for today. The stifling summer heat and humidity is taking a temporary break across the northeast in wake of a passing cold front. High temperatures on Tuesday and Wednesday dipped back into the 70s, northern New England, and 80s, southern New England, New York. Subtle relief will also be seen farther south into the mid-Atlantic region, where high temperatures become a few degrees cooler Tuesday and Wednesday than what was seen Sunday and Monday, but highs in the 90s will persist through midweek along with uncomfortably humid conditions. Heat advisories are in place from the Chesapeake Bay on south into the Carolinas today as heat indices over 105 degrees are expected. The cold front that passed through the northeast is forecast to stall from the east-central U.S. into the central plains on Tuesday. This front and another frontal system moving through the north-central U.S. will spark showers and thunderstorms from the heartland to the mid-Atlantic today and into Wednesday. Tuesday's slight risk area for severe weather resides in the central high plains, while several slight risk areas for flash flooding are located in the Great Lakes, mid-Mississippi Valley, and the mid-Atlantic. The threat for severe weather and flash flooding becomes focused in the northern mid-Atlantic and Ohio Valley on Wednesday. Farther south, a tropical wave will send showers and thunderstorms near the Florida Keys into the Gulf of Mexico midweek. This disturbance could generate heavy showers and thunderstorms along the central and western Gulf Coast the second half of the week. The National Hurricane Center is watching this tropical wave closely for potential development later this week. Across the western U.S., above-average heat will continue in Washington, Oregon into the Intermountain West on Tuesday. For Wednesday, highs in the mid-upper 90s are expected to shift east into the northern Rockies and High Plains, but a cold front provides cooler weather to the Pacific Northwest for Wednesday. This is James Johnson. Reporting for Extreme Weather, our weather information is derived from the National Weather Service, Weather Prediction Center, located in College Park, Maryland. Our outlook uses AI technology developed by Extreme Weather, and our audio broadcast is digitally mastered by Jarvis Media Group. Have a fantastic Tuesday. And please stay weather aware. This broadcast is made possible in part by Extreme Weather. Funding for this broadcast is provided in part by our viewers and their donations. We would like to thank our viewers for their continued support of this Extreme Weather program. Thank you for listening and please check back often for further weather updates that may impact you and your area.